Franken Inlet in Nunavut, and we are at the opening of our Canada Goose Resource Center. It's really important for us to find authentic ways to give back. Uh, the sowers up here don't have access to a lot of materials, and what they do is very expensive. So Danny Reese, the CEO, and I spent some time talking about how we could give away fabrics that we don't use anymore, colors we wouldn't use anymore, whatever we've used in our jackets that we can't use anymore to sowers in their communities in the north. It's very essential we have to have um, sewing skills to keep our family warm. Tradition is passed down for a uh, female by patterns and we measure everything by hand. I follow a, a lot of traditional patterns because there's reasons to them. So your body can breathe or it can uh, move. They're true artists, they're craftsmen, and the detail that goes into every single jacket that they make is amazing. Just to meet people like Victoria, who's a young, up-and-coming seamstress, and the tradition of making jackets and amautiques has been passed on from her grandmother to her mother to her. <laughs> The bottom piece here, I actually incorporated into this jacket. As you can see in my jacket, I have the amount of style, the loop at the bottom and it's important for me because it's my culture, it's my heritage. I just want to keep that tradition and still use, be able to do a modern style. So we partnered with First Air who very generously uh, agreed to ship pallets of materials in the quarterly shipments up north. They transport everything for us for free up to the communities that need them most. We've got resources in Pond Inlet in Iqaluit, and we've just opened one here in Rankin Inlet, and then we'll also launch one in Kujuak. Before, we lived out on the land, and now we live in communities. We're going from building to building, and it's hot, cold, hot, cold, and modern fabric is better for that. It's really good for today's living. Being able to give away all that material, I think it impacted a lot of people. And everyone was just so grateful. You could just feel the excitement in the arena. It was, it was really nice to see.